Welcome to Statics. Example, moment of a force. In this example problem, we will compute the moment about an axis caused by a system of forces. In this problem, we have a bent pipe fixed to a support at point O. Two forces, F1 and F2, act on the pipe. Their magnitudes, positions, and orientations relative to point O are provided. We are to find the moment they cause about point O. This is a two-dimensional problem, since the forces lie in the same plane. The axis of rotation points in a direction perpendicular to the screen out towards you. Point O is where that axis intersects the plane of the screen. We will solve this problem by summing moments about point O in a single equation. Our sign convention will be the standard convention, the right-hand rule, which I can show with this symbol. It shows that rotations acting in the counterclockwise direction are positive rotations. Let's begin by considering the moment caused by force F1, which is acting in the horizontal direction. I have extended the line of action of force 1 and drawn a circle centered at point O for visualization purposes. I get two useful pieces of information. First, its moment arm is perpendicular to the line of action, so in the y direction, and it is the radius of the circle, 1 meter. Also, I see the sense of direction. It is causing a clockwise rotation at point O, so I will call it a negative moment and write it like this. I put the force as negative 50 newtons and the moment arm in the y direction as 1 meter. Next, let's consider the moment caused by force F2. It is occurring at an inclination of 30 degrees from horizontal. The easiest way to deal with it is to break it into its vertical and horizontal components. The direction of the horizontal component aligns through point O, so let's move on to the vertical component. Again, for visualization, I draw a circle centered at point O that extends to the line of action of the vertical component of F2. We see that the moment arm distance is 3 meters in the perpendicular or x direction, and the rotation direction about point O is counterclockwise, or positive. I add this to the moment equation as 100 newtons times the sine of 30 degrees, with a moment arm of 3 meters we get an answer of 100 newton meters. Notice the units are force times distance. So why did the horizontal component of F2 not show up in our equation? If I extend the line of action of F2x, we see it passes through point O at the support. Therefore, its moment arm is zero. F2x does pull on point O, but does not cause rotation, and thus does not contribute to the moment. 